not bad, not bad. So, am I live though? That's the real question. Live. Ah, it is working. Very nice. That's what we like to see. Now to post it places in that. That's good. How do I open the... There it is. There she goes. Uh, can you see? You can see. Haha. -ha. Close. Hello, hello. If you can hear me, say something in the chat. It would be greatly appreciated. And let's post the links in that. In here? Nice, mate, nice. Hello, hello. Let me post this on the main channel. I can explain the situation. Fun time. Um, live stream to explain. What is going on, people? What is going on? No Kangen content? Uh, pretty much. Uh, I can't upload anything at all on the main channel, which I'll explain shortly. Cannot upload for potentially a month, which is very unfortunate. But hopefully it's not that long. It shouldn't be that long, but last time I went through this, it was very long. Um, how do I get rid of like this shit? I'll leave him there. Like what, what is this? Why do I have so much like shit on the screen? I forgot I did this when I set up the streaming stuff. There you go. Uh, Oma and Kano. There you go. Let's explain the situation. Put it on screen and that makes it like, much easier. Can't. What's going on? So, pretty much. The bad news is, I have three strikes again, all for Kangen content. That, that's the unfortunate news. Which means I cannot upload until at least one of my strikes disappears. And when the strike disappears, I'll go down to two, meaning I can upload. But for now, I have three. I can't upload. If I lose the appeals, I'll lose my channel. The main channel and probably this channel as well. Because apparently if you have one channel terminated on YouTube, they like delete everything. But yeah, I normally win the appeals. But this takes like 
two weeks, three weeks, stuff like that. I think it says 10 business days. That's how long I normally have to wait. Not bad, not bad, good fun. The chat is weird, I don't know why. I have to like read the chat on like the sketchy platform, not the good one. It's quite interesting. YouTube use Guhan on you. It seems like they just put me in the like ritual and I just got beat up. Man's dead at this point. The question now is where do I actually upload? Like I can upload on this channel still, but I'm not sure. I may just work on like a big video, like a 30 minute video in like the next few weeks to post when like a strike goes down and that'll be like the big return video. I might do that. Hold on, let me make sure it's working. PC's like scuffed right now. Is it working on my phone? Yeah, yeah there's my ugly voice. There it is. How'd I get the last strike? So pretty much, it's kind of like messed up, but I got one strike. They're all for old videos. Like, see this on screen here, Kangen Mega Bando 2020. So all the videos are from 2020, like three years ago now. I got one strike like about three weeks ago for my Jose video, Kangen Mega. I normally just appeal straight away, but that was like a dog shit video. So I'm like, who cares? They can take that video, I don't care. And then I got the second strike for a Kiru video like two days ago. I'm like, okay, I appealed both of them. And then I got the Bando one like yesterday. So now I have three strikes. They normally put like five or so videos culminating one strike. So that's all right when they do that. I just like appeal one thing and then I get all the videos back. But this time they did it like individually. One strike, one video, one strike, one video. So like I can't upload. What normally happens is I reply with like all my personal information to this. Because it's like a fully like legal thing. So like my real name, my address, stuff like that. I send it to whoever made the strike or YouTube sends it to them through me. And then they like have 10 business days to respond. If they respond... It could be like a court thing or whatever, but what normally happens for like every other channel is they don't respond, the video comes back, and then they pretty much repeat the same thing like a few months later. So it's good fun. Could you upload to Google Drive and share the vids? I could do that. The thing is, the videos like I have on my channel are still there. It's only these three videos, and I privated like 30 other videos that are like similar. Because in like 2019, 2020, I just made like a video on every random character and I would show a lot of panels like back then, just like the panels panning down the screen. I don't do that anymore to try and avoid this, but I did that a lot like in 2020. So I just privated a lot of videos that I think could potentially get striked later on. I had already lost like 40 something videos of my old reviews because I was reviewing Kangen Omega since like chapter 40 something between the Ryukyu and Bokinchi fight. I had a video for every week from like around then, but now you can only see ones like in the middle of the Purgatory vs Kangen tournament because I already lost all of those when I got like 20 something strikes like two years ago. So now I'm just sitting here waiting. When it comes to what's going on in Kangen Omega, I'm really enjoying the Okubo and Seki fight. I was planning to make a video this week, but, you know, the strike happened. I was like, shit. But I guess it's kind of a good thing as the fight's still going on, as I've kind of been waiting for the fight to actually end before I make a video on it. But it's still going on and not complaining. It's very great so far. But hopefully by the time the fight actually ends, my strikes be gone, I'll be able to sit down and make a video on like the last four or five chapters, I believe. Let me actually have a look. When's the last time I 
made a Kangen video. It's been a while because the Record of Ragnarok anime came out. I've been on that Record of Ragnarok grind. Can I pull this up on the screen? Hold up. Can you see this? Um, you can. So the last time I made a Kangen video was three weeks ago. And that was before the Seki vs. Okubo fight was going to begin. So I haven't talked about that fight at all. It was pretty interesting how they dropped that fight. I enjoyed it. Like, we thought we were going to, like, the new arc straight away, the inside. But we have Koga, like, being a bitch. Or Seki, assuming Koga's, you know, being a bitch. So he's like, let me show this dude how it's done. And then came in and now he's having his crazy fight with Okubo. So, of course, I... With everything I have, I want Seki to win. That's so... Regardless of who I think will win, Seki's going to win. It's, it's simple as that. Yeah, no, no build-up required. Who needs build-up when you can just provide greatness from, like, chapter 1? The art as well, like, for, like, the final pages where Seki, like, lands some crazy attack or Okubo lands his new techniques and all that has been pretty insane. I don't know where this insane art was for, like, the Purgatory Trauma or something like that. Imagine, like, Lolong and Oma got this type of treatment. That would have been pretty wild. But Seki's the goat, Okubo is the clown. So if Seki wins, it's going to be a great time. Hopefully, I'm begging that I have my, like, Strike removed by the time Seki wins. That would be, like, amazing. But in the meantime, while I wait for the strikes to disappear, I'm probably going to just work on a long video. I kind of have the idea what it's going to be. Always hate an Okubo? Of course. The number one agenda, the Okubo hate, must always be occurring. I need some hydration though. Do, 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 do. Hopefully the stream doesn't get, you know, age restricted for the bad word I said before. That would be very unfortunate. That would be depression to the max. Nah, it's alright. Sure why I might. Um, right now, when it comes to my channel, I don't know. I've appealed all the strikes. That takes like two weeks to three weeks to process. I normally win, so I should lose the strikes and be back to normal. I can upload, but I don't know. I They could like respond and I could keep the strikes and then my channel gets deleted. So right now, I don't know. I'm in like limbo in between. Do I keep my channel? Do I not keep my channel? I can't say. Of course, optimistic, I'm going to say I win the strikes like I always do, or win the appeals like I always do, and then I'll go back down to two strikes, eventually go back down to zero. Then I can upload until all of this happens again, like it always does, but it is what it is. I may begin streaming more on this channel in the meantime. I'm not sure, because I tried turning this into my Jujutsu Kaisen channel, if you can tell by the uploads, but then I stopped reading like the manga I got kind of not bored it was kind of stressful covering it every week I was I felt like I was being forced and I got like burnt out so I stopped reading it all so my last video was like on chapter 186 I haven't read it since that like chapter I haven't read past chapter 186 since I made that video and I have seen spoilers about what's going on right now so who knows I could catch up in the meantime I am pretty busy with personal stuff right now, which is, I guess, okay, considering I can't upload, but it is what it is. If Okubo wins, which he will, should we expect Okubo hate video? If he wins, I will make a video, like, not specifically hate, it won't be like that, it'll just be like a regular video, it's like, oh yeah, somehow, some way. Magically, Okubo is able to defeat Seki. I don't know what the author is smoking, but that happened. Don't know why. Maybe some, you know, mistake. Mistake in the writing department occurred with Okubo winning that. That's what I'll talk about. But yeah, Seki's going to win, so it's alright. Hopefully, I'll see you again in the future. Hey man, you will. Don't worry about that. I may return on this channel with Jutsu Kaisen content, I may stream on it more, or I may just like upload whatever in the meantime if I get bored. Because that, you know, 
does be occurring time to time. So if you if some random video appears on the channel here and there in the next like three weeks, blame the boredom. Don't know if I'm gonna read Jutsu Kaisen, make like a big video like that. We'll have to wait and see. Yeah, I saw spoilers about what happened regarding Sukuna. That like kinda persuaded me to, you know, begin reading it again, but haven't really had that much time. But I might who knows? If I do, I'll probably like make a big video from like I may just make a whole video on the Culling Games, like from the start of the Culling Games to now, like maybe like a recap or like a big thing if I was to read it. I'll probably do something like that. Read one chapter per day. I could do that, but I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. I might. I got like three weeks now. Or I got like two weeks. I'm hoping two weeks. I appealed one of them like two days ago. And it says 10 to 15 business days. If I lose my channel, like if that channel gets deleted, apparently YouTube deletes all my channels. So I'll lose this channel as well. If that does happen, I don't know. Depression time? Probably make a new channel, honestly. There's probably like a loophole to get around it or some shit, I don't know. The grind will not be ending though, that's for sure. Streaming software. Like the only videos on this mysterious Chad channel that get views is like my Bucky videos I uploaded like three years ago when I was dealing with strikes like last time. Which is kind of funny. I haven't read 10 chapters. What's H and I? Oh, how do you know you pay for five minutes and caught up in a few days? Yeah, but that, that shit, you know. I haven't read anything new apart from like Bucky, Kangen, and Record of Ragnarok in like months. Like nothing new whatsoever. Uh, what's going on new to the channel? I only came to it from the Record of Ragnarok stuff. So pretty much. Apart from Record of Ragnarok, I talk about a series called Kangen Archer and Kangen Omega. Ever since I started my channel, I've been getting strikes for that. And when I get free strikes, it means I can't upload for like two or three weeks while I appeal those strikes. So currently I have free strikes, meaning I can't upload on the main channel. So I just have to wait three weeks to see what happens with the appeal. If I lose the appeals, I lose my channel as a whole, like YouTube deletes it. I highly doubt that's going to happen as I normally win all the strikes or win all the appeals and then my channel comes back. It's just like a two week, three week thing where I can't upload. That's the annoying part. And then it'll probably like rinse and repeat in like a few months time. So yeah, because the Raws or the new chapter for Record of Ragnarok comes out in around like five or six days, something like that, seven days, I think. No, eight days. Yeah, the new Record of Ragnarok chapter comes out in eight days, so there won't be a video on that until like a week after. That's, you know, in regards to you if you only watch the Ragnarok stuff. I watched the, I think the first two seasons of Hajime no Ippo. I think. I was gonna, was there a first, I watched the first season, I know that. I forgot where I stopped watching. Cause I was watching it on like some sketchy site and then I, like I lost access to that site or I lost like the bookmark so I forgot what episode I was up to and I haven't really watched really much anime as well. The process sucks. It, it does suck. Like I'm used to it now. I used to be, when I first got the strikes cause I got like 20 something strikes like two years ago for the Kangen like chapter videos. That was like rip. That's why I made this channel I believe initially. But yeah, that was like unfortunate but now i'm just used to it i'm like oh yeah new strikes just make a community face be like i may lose a channel unlucky but we'll have to wait and see probably gonna win oh i know post stuff here for now but yeah just just annoying at this point because always the same email because it's technically like the publisher of the kengen like in japan whatever the fuck they're called it's the publisher but Whoever's sending these emails definitely doesn't like watch the videos. 
they're just like, oh yeah, Kang and Omega, time to send the strike. Because they never reply, so I don't really get the point. It's like they're like trolling me at this point. Um, if you have any questions, of course, leave them down in the chat. I'm just vibing for now. I'll probably head to the gym in like an hour or so. That is my plan for the day. Hopefully we also get the Kangen and, um, what's it called, Bucky anime seasons this year. It's looking promising. They're both confirmed. Even if you go on Netflix and like look at Kangen on it, it says like the next season is coming. So can't wait for that. Bucky's already had a trailer for the Pickle Arc. So absolute greatness. If you lose a channel, VTuber Korea is waiting for you. Uh, VTuber Korea, no thank you. Venus versus Delirious, who is stronger? Venus versus Delirious, say, time to a power here. Venus Gaming, so his, you know, power level is 25 million. Uh, I mean, that's pretty strong. Isn't he like buff as well? Hold up. Venus Gaming. So he's like, he's not buff, he's like, he looks alright. But delirious. Isn't he like one of his friends? Ah. Isn't he like HD delirious? I don't even know how to spell. Delirious. Ah, 13 million? So based on subs, you know, Venos is stronger. Yeah. What about content? That's the other question. Vanos Gaming. Shave your legs and search for a good 3D anime girl model. Model, I mean. I have never shaved my legs in my life. That's like, I think the only part of my body I've never shaved. Hey, my, my legs are hairy as fuck as well. I think Kang and Omega Rito is stronger than Ashra Okibo. I think that's fair. Compared to views. So what do we have? We have... Hey, he's making Black Ops 3 content. We've got to respect that. So Venos uploads every two days, it seems like. Gets like... Between a mil and like 500k. We'll say after like a week or so, he gets like around a mil. Some two mil. Yeah, around a mil. Delirious gets like... Yeah, yeah. Only gets like 50k, 70k, maybe 100k here and there. So yeah, Venos stomps. Seems like Venos is the winner here. It's not really YouTube striking them. It's the toxic Japanese like publishers doing it. Because apparently when I looked into it, like the shit's been going on with like anime YouTubers for like years at this point. Japan doesn't really have fair use laws, but the issue is YouTube is an American platform and of course America has fair use laws. Most Western countries do, or most countries in the world do, apart from like Japan. So when they see something that's like under their copyright, they're like, oh, can't have that, time to strike it, they don't really know. That's why a lot of YouTubers or anime YouTubers join something known as like an MCN, where they give a percentage of their revenue, I don't know how much it is, and they pretty much have the ability through this MCN to like block their videos in Japan so it just doesn't happen. I considered doing it at this some point, but the one I like emailed and like reached out to was a little bit sketchy, so I like I wasn't really sure. So I got like scared and like nah, didn't reply. Uh wouldn't Esterosa be stronger than Melodus? Because he is the strongest Archangel, and then he absorbed Four Sin, which is half if the Demon King's power, yet he got beaten by the King's True Form. Um, I, I dropped Seven Deadly Sin, so I don't know what you're talking about, mate. I know who Esther Rosa is, I know that he's like the Archangel and all that stuff, but I, I, don't, I don't know how to answer that one, boss. Will you do gaming stream? 
Um, maybe. I don't really play much games at this point or nowadays. Like, I haven't really played anything. There's like no games to play, which is kind of sad. I was looking at the Harry Potter game. I was going to like, I don't know, try that out, I guess, but this didn't happen. That would suck because I'm from Japan. I love you. Hey, a Japanese viewer. Hey. I'm probably not going to do that. Join the MCN and get my videos blocked in Japan. And now that I know I have like people in Japan watching my videos. I definitely won't do that. But yeah. Hey, it's pretty cool to hear. Should, you know, knock on those <laughs> publisher doors. <laughs> Workout stream. Um... Well, I don't really feel too comfortable working out or recording, you know, public gyms. I don't really have a home gym. Maybe I'll record my my bim, myself benching today, and like I don't know, bro, bro, blur out my face or something. I don't know. Nogla versus delirious and random misspeaking rumors. Yeah. Nogla stomps. I don't know what this guy's saying. I don't understand your language, my G. Imagine it being the old videos though, like, come on man, why is it the old videos? Just make it like new videos if you have a problem. Like, why are videos from 2020? And like, five minute like shitty videos as well. Like, how'd they even find these videos in like, the YouTube sh search to like, strike them? Esteroids will not be Meliodas. Didn't Esteroids get like, Stomped by um, Pride Boy, whatever his name is. I actually forgot his name. I can't believe it. The Sin of Pride. I haven't watched Seven Deadly Sins in so long. Honest thoughts on us leaving rent. Or us, us living. I think you mean rent free in villain's head. Um. I wonder when I have to actually pay my rent money for that. Like, jeez, that that must be a lot. Hello, foul ghoul, mate. How's it going? Venice Crew is my early YouTube term. I loved even them from Poland. Nice. Um, the only stuff I really watched from Venice was like the Black Ops 2 zombies and like ninja defusing stuff. That was like my main content I enjoyed. I got the Carlo video back. That was in like the previous strike. And I ended up like winning that. Because that's like, I don't know why the Carlo video got like 60k views or whatever. But I did private like 40 videos like yesterday on my channel. There's still quite a bit I missed, but there's like 40 of the old videos similar to like these ones I just privated. Like Kangan Omega, like Okubo video. I just got rid of that or privated it. I think I watched season 3, but I just got bored. I think um, the barn i think his name is was in hell hell or whatever and that's like the last thing i remember seeing he was like in hell and then like something like that he was like looking for meliodas's soul that's all i remember I used to watch a lot of YouTube videos on Seven Deadly Sins from like, hold up, I think, yeah, Nux Taku, his name was. I used to watch a lot of videos on Seven Deadly Sins from here. I don't know what he uploads now, like VTuber stuff. I don't really watch any of that. Oh, um, how do I even check? Most popular. Yeah, stuff like this, I used to watch a lot for Seven Deadly Sins. I was like a decently big fan. I never read it or anything, but once I saw the shitty quality of the later seasons, I just stopped completely. Um, the, the first one's definitely better, quote-wise. Been waiting on Kangen Ashura Season 3 for a long time, but apparently they're animating the rest of the series of Season 3. That's what they said on the... Like, the publisher of the, like, manga for... Not the publisher. The editor for the Kangen Omega manga said on Twitter that they're apparently working on completing, like, the whole series for the next anime season. But it wasn't really clear of whether that's, like, the whole 
rest of the series is coming out when the next season drops or they just like confirm that they're working on it until completion. That's what we don't really know. If you look at how much material was covered in the first two seasons, it'll need to be a lot longer unless they're skipping a lot of stuff, which I hope they're not. So I'm guessing there's going to be more seasons just confirming that they're like going to complete it on Netflix or something like that. It should come out this year. I'm hoping they announced it like a while ago now. If you go on Netflix, it should say it's like a new season is coming like on the actual app itself. So good news regarding that. Uh, Attack on Titan. I so I read the manga. I like read. I watched the first like two or three seasons, and then I decided to read the manga. I finished it, and then I haven't watched really much of the like anime seasons since I finished it. Apparently, it's still like ongoing. It's like being Attack on Titan final season part four or some shit. I don't know how they managed to do that. So I had my channel banned from Free Strikes and recovered it after some time, luckily two months after. You recovered your channel from Free Strikes. Now that is promising. So you, what were the strikes for though? Because I've never really heard of a channel being like recovered from strikes. They better not cheap out on Waka vs Julius. Well considering it's the first fight of the next season, they should like, you know, go ham with it. It is one of the best fights in the series, so I highly doubt they're going to disappoint. Copyright infringement, I see. I made a video talking about it, but after playing three times and being rejected. I used to get rejected for when I would like send the appeals because YouTube needs to like view your like application for appealing first, but now I have like the perfect written out script on like the reason it's wrong, so it, it is like automatically gets appeals at this point, like in like a few hours. I submit it, they like read my long paragraph that I copy and paste in for every video, I'm like, oh yeah, and then they send it off to whoever sent the strike for not for them not to, you know, reply for like three weeks, and then I get my video back. And then the like appear like three months later sending strikes again. True, it's been a while since I like uploaded on this channel, which is kind of funny. I can't. I was surprised when I saw that it was seven months. So I haven't read a Jutsu Kaisen chapter in seven months. That is quite some time. So there's definitely a lot of stuff that's happened. How would you feel about us finding an entire clan of Hunmas and Baki, or at least backstory of them? Finding an entire clan, I don't think would really happen. Of course, we have the theory of Yujiro spreading his seed throughout the world. That means there's more Hanma children, stuff like that. A clan, I don't think so, but a backstory of them would be pretty cool. Like, the father of Yujiro. Even just stuff about, like, a dedicated manga about Yujiro would be cool. But the way, like, they kind of implemented the like weird history and potentially alien stuff into the Bucky vs. Yudro fight with like the ancient Egypt stuff. There could be like some crazy stuff that may come out in the future. But if I had to place a bet, I don't think really anything regarding the Hanma family will be expanded on before like the story ends, however it does end. But hopefully it does. Who was that guy that comments on your Every video sounds like a fan, every YouTuber needs a... I think that person's called the number one Octubo wanker. Maybe. I, I don't know. I don't know. The appealing should work. Once, I think, like, sometime last year when I was appealing one, it, like completed it was like after the 15 business days and it was like sitting there for three months so i went on twitter and like did the complaint thing then they like fixed it like i don't even know how they managed to do that hopefully all goes well hopefully i don't get more strikes that would be pretty annoying if i had like five strikes and then like once i lose one another strike comes and i'll never be able to upload that would be you know very unfortunate how long have I been streaming for, though? The real question. 
Take a little bit of time. Surprising because I haven't streamed in like quite some time as well. I was going to put the webcam on for this stream, but I hadn't really, because I just got home like about an hour ago or like 20 minutes before I started the stream and I hadn't really set up anything. So I just like, nah, I can't be bothered. I don't know if I'm going to like accidentally take off like my mask or whatever if I was to do a live stream with it on, that would be very awkward. Who do you enjoy more as a character, Jack Hanuma or Ryan? Um, character writing wise, Jack Hanma, but for like specific moments, probably Ryan. I'm trying to give Record of Ragnarok a chance, but I get bored of watching the fight. Um, so yeah, we all know the anime really isn't that good. I think season two is better than season one, but still, compared to like many other things coming out these days, it really isn't like up to par whatsoever. I just watch it because, you know, big fan, go to see what's going on, and I still enjoyed season two, and I even enjoyed season one, but hopefully, I know they keep on improving, but the manga is definitely the better option as a whole. We was peak in 2030. YouTube can suck it for taking our videos of that year. Unlucky, unlucky. I, bro, if you haven't seen Seraph of the End, I have watched Seraph of the End. One of the first animes I watch, I recommend watching it. It's big time, it's an amazing show. Yeah, I have seen it with the vampires and all that. P pretty cool. Very good music, if I remember correctly. Ever going to make more Hunter x Hunter videos? Um, I think I've made two Hunter x Hunter videos. When I watched the anime, I think I uploaded that on this channel. I made a video like talking about every episode or whatever. That video took a while to make. I don't know why I made it because it did like pretty shit. But I made that and of course my Yudro vs Hunter x Hunter video. I don't actually read the manga or I started reading it. I read like the Crollo and Hisoka fight and then I like... Just didn't read anything else. That was it. So, it's kind of hard to read. I find the, the manga for Hunter x Hunter very hard to read. So much like dialogue and like... The art ain't really all that good. So, probably you won't make anything. Yeah, there it is. I made this video. Every Hunter x Hunter episode reviewed. That took a while. Because I you know, watch every episode. Write like, I don't know, 20, 30 words about us. And, yeah... For quite some time. Imagine Bucky top 10 gets taken down up to 3 years, 1 million views. Surprisingly, out of like everything I cover, or like the main big three, Bucky, Kangan, and Record of Ragnarok, Bucky's the only stuff I've never got a copyright strike for. When Record of Ragnarok Season 1 came out, I got strikes on like old reviews and like character videos like I lost my Adam video my Sasaki video and like a few others that had pretty decent views as well but I lost all those videos when the first season came out and I think one random like review at some point as well but that's all for record of Ragnarok maybe like 10 videos as a whole Kangen probably like 60 videos at this point I've lost but Bucky I have not lost anything Hey man, so what's been up with your channel? Everything okay? Uh, not really okay. Pretty much I got three strikes, so I can't upload while I'm appealing these strikes for like two or three weeks. That's pretty much the summary. I've explained it like more detail like at other parts in the stream if you want to check it out. Do you play Tekken? I have played Tekken before, but I wouldn't really call myself like knowledgeable or someone who really plays it. What do you think if Barking Omi get added? If they were to get added in like a DLC, that's when I have to actually buy the game. Like 100%, no questions asked. Like, yep, I'm buying that. Yeah, rip to the Record right now character videos. They probably weren't even that good anyway, but unlucky. It was like right before the anime came out, so it was like so toxic. Like, those videos were gonna like, they already had pretty decent views, but they were like getting a lot of views. Then the anime came out and they're like, nah, 
Goodbye. I haven't seen any of those soccer anime. That's right, soccer. I was going to watch the Blue Lock one, but just never got around to it. Uh, we don't know the release date for Kangen Season, but on Netflix, the app itself, it says the next season is coming. So I guess we just have to wait for the best. If I had to make a bet, I do think it's going to come out this year, but we truly do not know. I will definitely make a video if we do get like a release date, so stay tuned for that on the main channel. Apparently the CEO of YouTube stepped down today. I've been seeing that on Twitter, that's pretty interesting. Quite ironic. Maybe she was like scared of me and my appeal, she's like that can't handle this and my cute legs. That's my theory for now. Don't, 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 don't. It's football to what Dragon Ball is to martial arts. I see. So it's like the OG big boy. Blue Lock manga is in the top three manga I've ever read. Let's have a look. Blue Lock. Like, I've seen panels here and there. But... It, it looks pretty, pretty hype. Like I said, I was going to watch the anime for it. I just didn't get around to it. It kind of reminds me of like the, um, what's that basketball anime called? Oh, Kuroko no Basket, where like they all have some type of mini superpower. Kind of looks like that to me. Have you seen anything with the YouTube Scepter Programmer? Yes. So, I was a fan of, like, Scepter Programmer. I'm still a fan of, like, Clyde, uh, Swag, Kage, pretty much everyone else involved. So, yes, I watched, like, pretty much everything regarding that. Like, the Clyde video, the Keemstar, like, six-hour stream. So, yeah, I watched all that. That's, you know, some very messed up situation. Apparently it's still going as well, like there's still stuff coming out. I saw Swear Kage post like a stream like explaining some other stuff. I haven't got around to watching that yet, but apparently there's still more wild shit coming out. Uh, Reckon Ragnarok anime is so rough. I love the idea of Reckon Ragnarok. But me and my friend cringe through the whole... Oh, no, don't even talk about the Adam vs. Zeus fight. I don't know why they chose to do that, like... Going into the anime, I think as a whole for like the manga readers and like the way people have hyped up the series, that was the fight that even myself were like hyping up like this is going to blow up the internet. And then for that fight, they chose to like do the worst like animation possible. Instead of like blowing up in a good way of like being so fire, it blew up in like how shit it was. Like how shit the animation, the like PowerPoint, which is like, man, that is, that is quite unfortunate. Best Rage Boy of the Venus Boys, um, Wildcat. From what I've heard, Seth's doing a response, but I don't know if he can really say to refute most of it. He's probably just going to like, um, like refute the pedo stuff, cause like, ain't nobody want to be called a pedo. But I don't. Yeah, I agree with you. I don't know how he's gonna like disprove everything that was said. Wasn't it like a 50 page document or something exposing him? And like, I think he admitted to like most things on the Keemstar stream or whatever as well. So I don't know. Unlucky. Rips. Rest in peace. If they were to reanimate the old Grappler Baki series, that would be, you know, quite fire. I'll be pretty, pretty hype. 58 pages, yeah, like... How can people make a 58 page document of you and you're gonna like disprove everything in there? There's probably like some like stretch stuff or like some bullshit in there, but once it gets to something that long, just like, man, unlucky. Yeah, he admitted a lot. Yeah, so I, I like, I didn't like 
pay attention. I like, had it in background, like when I was like editing videos here and there. So I didn't really focus too much on it, but yeah, fairly so. I remember like him admitting to like most shit. I think it was just him trying to like go against the pet pedo allegations. He was like, I don't care about all the other stuff. This I'm not a pedo. Like, okay, so you still like huge scumbag. Yeah, I didn't. I found season two of Wreck Ragnarok much better. I uh, can't upload. Yeah, pretty much free strikes on the main channel, so I can't upload until pretty much I win the appeals in like two or three weeks. Uh, have you ever thought about doing videos on Berserk? It's really good. I've done a few videos on Berserk here and there. I think I reviewed one chapter on this channel. I made like a few videos a while ago, like like years ago at this point, talking about like certain characters. And I tried like making the characters in Dark Souls 3 and like using that as like the video stuff. Have you, um, what was I reading? What about the mini lead drama? I don't know who mini lead is, so I know nothing about that. Is Mini Lad a U Mini Lad? Sounds like a Minecraft YouTube if I'm being honest. Mini Lad. Um Ah, oh, it's this guy. Wait, he doesn't even upload it anymore. I don't know what he did, but yeah. I've uh, seen this person before. I perhaps require some hydration to live on. Da, 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 da. Apart from the strikes and not being able to upload, we got good news approaching 70k on the main channel. Should hit that in like a few weeks, I guess. Because the second I got the free strikes, I like looked at the view graph on like the Mysterious Weave channel and it just goes down by like 90% as soon as you get free strikes. So pretty much nuking all the videos that were doing well at this point. Which is like unfortunate. It seems to happen a lot. I think around when I reached 60k, I also got like free strikes and couldn't upload. So like now upon reaching 70k, I have like the same thing again. I, since like the author died and like the other people took over of completing the manga, I read the first chapter that was like newly, newly released, but I didn't read anything after that, or I haven't yet. I did buy the first physical volume, like the, the big black one, the deluxe editions. I bought that, I saw it like on sale somewhere, because I was like this looking for volume one. And maybe in the future I'll like try and collect them all, but I got volume one of that, which is pretty cool. I've only seen, I've never even seen any of the anime for Berserk really, I only like clips from the old one. Like, and like edited clips on YouTube stuff. Yeah, the YouTube CEO stepped down. I don't, hopefully, it's just pretty much Japanese people exploiting stuff, that's literally, or Japanese company, whoever, in the publisher thing, exploiting stuff, just wasting people's time, because they never reply anyway, it's just, I don't know, annoying. Oh, Jesus. Mmm. Quite hot today for me, quite deadly. Um, so what I'm currently doing for One Punch Man, I don't review every chapter. I pretty much wait for like six or seven chapters to come out and then I make like a big video talking about. I'll show you what I, I uploaded one not too long ago. So where is it? There. So I pretty much make a better edited video 
like after five or six chapters come out. That's what I'm currently doing with One Punch Man. Because making like single chapter reviews on it, I feel as though they're not really good videos. And that if I take my time and like talk about like a few chapters in one video, it's better. Um, my YouTube premium is not on this account. So yeah, I, I, do, I do have YouTube premium. Like, more edited stuff. So, like, last thing I talked about was... I think before Saitama and Tatsumaki began fighting. So, I'll probably make another video in, like, two... Oh, I can't actually make videos right now due to strikes, but yeah. Probably, like, two weeks or something like that. Three weeks, I'll make another video. I also bought a camera as well. Over, like, the last month or so. So, no more super low quality shit like this. Always on that improvement grind. Like, I get more views doing, like, making a video as the chapter comes out. But, yeah, I just, I just don't. I just don't feel like they're good videos. So, there's, there's really no point doing it to me at this point. Uh, when are you going to make more Kangen videos? So, if you don't know what's happening, I have three strikes right now, four Kangen videos, meaning I can't upload anything in general. So, yeah. Uh, we'll just have to wait and see what happens regarding Kangen content. I want to make videos. I wanted to talk about the Seki and Okubo fight, but right now I cannot make anything. But once I win these appeals and I go back to hand the two strikes and I can upload... I will make a video talking about Seki vs Okubo, as it's still going on, surprisingly. I thought it would have ended this week, but still going on, so hopefully they like extend it one more week so it finishes as my strikes disappear, and then I can, you know, make the video on it. Like, on like five chapters at this point of Kangen. The longest time I haven't really made a video on Kangen. It could get deleted if I lose these appeals, pretty much. It's a very good fight. It's probably, honestly, so far, one of the best fights I've had in Kangen Omega. Even art-wise, like, when they do those crazy, like, kind of rough art for, like, the final panels of, like, Seki, like, kneeing Okubo in the head at the last, at the end of last chapter and stuff like that, like, they're going in for the art. Wish they should've, wish they did that for, like, Lolong versus Omo or something like that. But... This random fight out of nowhere, and it is providing the goods. True, Okubo's face should be looking quite interesting. Even though I, like, dislike Okubo, I'm glad he finally got an improvement, because he was one of the few characters in the Purgatory vs. Kangen tournament that seemed like he didn't really change outside of his striking improving, according to, like, Carlos, or his striking being pretty solid. I should win the appeals. Is this like a time thing where I, just, you know, have to wait two or three weeks? But I shall be back soon, hopefully, most likely. So regarding Joyce's Gotota attack, I believe the narr the narrator, like in one of the panels when he's using it. Literally outright states, no one can withstand that blow. So, if you take it literally, and that's like a narrator statement, Julia should one-shot any character if he lands that attack. Which is, you know, quite mental. See, one thing to remember if Seki does win this fight is he went into it with, like, no prep time because Okubo's, like, opponent backed out. So Seki's like, okay, I'll pull up and show this guy how it's done. So, yeah. If Seki wins this, Okubo clowning will be amped up to the maximum. If you compare the panels of the Hammer of Burma and Kaku's, like, punch, they're, like, similar. It seems like the 
Kaku is the one was more extreme, but if you want to argue it that way, it could kind of say they're around the same, or Saw Pang's attack was like stronger. It's just more so the like Kaku Kai's like Zali ability, which is like kind of busted. It's not really planned, it's like Okubo was prepared to fire, like conditioned and all that. Seki's like, okay, let's fire and pull it up. And that, that, that's, what I'm, that's what I'm gonna say at least. It's 2 20 a.m. where I live, unlucky mate, unlucky. What's the bad news? Um, free strikes, can't upload on the main channel, could lose the channel if I don't win the appeals. That's like the rough version in like 10 seconds. I think I've said this like 40 times now. I'm getting a bit of a headache. That's alright. I'm here to release the bad news. Oh, it's so hot for me. I'm dying. But it's, it's good to be streaming again. Haven't done this in quite some time. Yo, top. Apparently, the... What was I going to say? I literally just forgot what I was going to say. Unlucky. The new Record Ragnarok rules come out in like 8 or so days. So we could be seeing the end of the Tesla versus Belzebub fight. Personally, I hope we don't. I hope there's a still a few more chapters and we actually get, you know, Belzebub's transformation. The flashback should be done, but hopefully... I have, you know, channel strikes removed by the time that comes out so I can actually talk about it because that shit is very exciting. And then we could have the round nine very soon, which, once again, I am predicting to be um, Okita Suji versus Loki. Because I've been saying that for, like, multiple fights at this point. What's your plan for not getting any more strikes? Well... There's only, there's a few options I can do. So I can join a MCN and get my videos blocked in Japan. So I should stop getting strikes. But if I do that, I have to like give a percentage of like my revenue. And it's kind of a bit sketchy if I'm being honest. I, tr I reached out to one and spoke to him at some stage. And it didn't really seem like all that, a little bit sketchy. So I'm not too sure I'm going to do that. And someone in the chat said before... He's in Japan and wouldn't be able to watch my videos if I do that. So maybe I won't do that. I could just outright delete all my old Kangen videos. I did private like 20 or 30 or so like yesterday that are like similar type to the three that got striked. Like the Kangen Omega, Okubo, Kangen Omega, Galang, stuff like that. That's one way to deal with it, I guess. But honestly, I just have to deal with it just... It is what it is. There's no real way around it. From the mods, who do you know lives in Europe? Um, I don't know. Let's see. Who are the mods? How are the mods? I'm pretty sure Kenneth lives in Europe. I think that's all I know. I think most are like American or like Asian countries. And Nubis, Nubis being next would be very hype. One of the gods who hasn't even been like mentioned in the series whatsoever. Old man, true. Old man's a British bruv. He's a British bruv. We are technically past the halfway point of Record of Ragnarok, unless there's like future story after the tournament itself, like a war and all that, which I think is a possibility. Oh, that's right. I remember the video I was going to work on in like the next three weeks while I can't upload. It was going to be like a Record of Ragnarok Theory Iceberg video. I've seen like iceberg videos everywhere. I'm like, maybe I can make one just on theories I have. Cause I don't want to like take someone else's like theory thing. I just want to maybe do something like that, but... Not too sure yet. I have to think about it. 
forgot about Tud. So he's like pretty sure something as well, I think. Make a Rumble account. Isn't that like the Andrew Tate side? I think I'm good, mate. Marco, Marco, Marco. Look at this. Kenyan hot takes on screen right now. Oh my god. Who would have guessed? Maybe I'll do a stream answering all the hot takes. That would like, I guess, save editing time for sure. Maybe that's the go-to. No, it's a platform where you can just post anything. Yeah, but that's like, for now, as soon as they have like, as soon as they get big enough, they're going to have to like start making regulations, you know, to be in line with, or in line with copyright laws and stuff. That's probably for now. As soon as they get big enough, then they're going to have to go through like a similar situation or they're going to have to deal with probably like a huge lawsuit or something like that and then they're probably going to go out of business. Name European countries. We've got Germany. We've got Poland. we got the Czech Republic. we got Sweden. we got Finland. we got all these other countries. There's, there's a lot of European countries. Adam vs. Gara, any form, who wins? We discussed this in the Discord, what's your take? Um, I'm assuming you're saying Adam from Record of Ragnarok? Um, hmm. Shit. Uh, hey, I, I could make a video on that. I'm not going to answer I'm going to make a video on that. I'm going to make the thumbnail right now, and I'm going to make that video. So that, that seems pretty interesting. Verse. Isn't like Turkey in Europe as well technically? Like partly, so is Russia. Like there's too many countries in Europe, mate. I'm, I'm not naming them all. Let's see. Adam Record of Ragnarok. Well, I'm going to open my, my other thing. So I can post. Dun, 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 dun. What happened to my YouTube channel? Um, I have free strikes right now, meaning I can't upload and I could lose my channel if I don't win the appeals. Pretty much that. And then you have like Africa of like 50 countries as well, some shit. Like, yeah, that shit wild. Um, I want to use like the Garo form, like the Cosmic Garo. I want to use that v version for the thumbnail because, you know, that's the, the strongest version. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Uh, should I use that or should I use one where you like looking to the side? I'll probably do one where he's like looking to the side, I think. That, that, that ain't it, mate. Is this shit alright? Oh my god. It's talking to me. My computer's like, you can't do that, mate. Let me save something so I don't forget in the future. Uh, what's the name of the music that you played at the beginning of your Buddha vs. Zeus? I shall check for you right now. I don't think I have the file anymore, so I'll just have to listen, I guess. At the start? 
Mate, I need to I need to be on my other account. I cannot watch ads. I can't handle this. Okay. Okay, um, this song or music is called, is this one? Nope. Yeah. Um, can you, can you see the title when I pull that up? You can't. So pretty much the title is this one down here, Nightmares in Dash RKVC. So that is the the song that is what it's called okay where was I uh, what would you do if your YouTube channel gets deleted probably just make another one until that gets deleted I don't know don't want to think about that can you throw for me I thought Lutian is gonna smash half of them and then he just dies like why even put him in the story um, I don't know, man. The current king of fight be quite fire. That's what I'm gonna say. Okubo versus Seki. Bro, can this? Can I post this, please? There you go. Oh my god. I was actually losing my mind then. Hold up. Why this centered, mate? I want to do something like that where like Garo is facing him and then Adam is facing Garo. That is the the plan for the thumbnail. No, no, no. I gave up from King after Edward Wu died, such a letdown. Well, if you keep kept on reading, you'll find out that he's technically still alive. So he's technically not dead. This guy retracted his message. I can hear you. You can hear me? That's good. Why did you delete your message, mate? What are you doing, mate? What are you doing, mate? Um, Adam. Adam from Rico Ragnarok. Marco talking about Venice people still. I see, I see. So there's like a card game for Record of Ragnarok or like cards and I just found this art like what is what is that? Quite quite suspect. I'll leave it on for like a few seconds. You know, I, I don't know if that's if it's, that's allowed. It's quite suspect. you mm you -mm -mm -mm. Uh, too big. I want it like similar size to what our boy is. That's uh, kind of close enough. If I like make it bigger. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, no. It's not bad, not bad, not bad. Best game to lose your friends is Mario Kart or Uno. Probably Uno, man. That shit causes fights. I've been in fights on that shit. Oh my god. Don't do that, mate. Oh my god. Like, why is Adam's head so big? Uh, I've explained it many times, but quickly, I have pretty much free strikes on the main channel. When you get free strikes on YouTube, you can't upload until you go down to two strikes. Right now, I'm in the process of appealing all those strikes. They're for Kangen content. So for the next two or three weeks, I can't upload until I hopefully win the appeals. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, someone commented before, like, asking my opinion, and I think it would be a good video. So, I am making the thumbnail for, maybe this will be my return video. I, like, spend the next three weeks making it, like, perfect, and then 
that will be my return video. We shall see. I think it's going to be good. Cheers to my dude who mentioned that. Um, I want something, but I don't know where it is. I think it's this one. There you go. I'll give you, for the video idea, I will give you... Moderator. There you go. You have moderator for the streams due to your greatness. Team Ogre? You draw has a team? No problem, mate. Thank you more. Too big, eh? Too big, mate. What did you just line? Hold up. Search Team Ogre. I will in 20 seconds. Human Whitehead Gara vs Buckyverse. I actually made that video like three years ago or something like that, two years ago. And I still think Yudro beats up Human Goro. So yeah. Even though, for some reason, a lot of comments on that video are like, Goro wins, but they proceed to talk about every other version of Goro. Like, I think I made it very clear in like every part of the video that I was talking about the, you know, human hunter Garo, not like any monsterized forms. But that's YouTube comments for you. Um, hold up. I want to add something to it. It looks a bit funky. What I do sometimes for thumbnails is for example, I go to my main channel and like I look at most viewed and like I look at what thumbnails did fairly well or what videos. So like this one, the Yudro vs. Yuchiro, like vs. The Honest Truth. Like sometimes just adding The Honest Truth to it makes it do better for some reason, I don't know. I I don't see the strikes like failing or like going through so I should be able to upload again in like the next few weeks. If I can't, that's just unlucky, but if all goes well I should be returning. The honest truth. Oh, what did I just do? Why did I change the color? Why did it go like gray? What did I just press? Oh my god. Right, what if I put it on this screen? I don't know what I pressed. I'm sad now. An hour and... 14 minute stream, oh my god. I have never streamed this long before in my life. Was that a lie? Uh, where was that Yujo video? So like I did the verse low, but that was because their faces were in the way. Maybe I just like... Um... Yeah, maybe I, maybe I don't need the honest truth in it this time. Maybe I'll just leave it like that. You streamed the debate for two hours? I did. 
I don't remember that. Probably did. Back in the day, long ago, far away, there was a land where I cared about the beats. I didn't even really care about the beats. I just found them entertaining to like listen to because in all the, like, the debates that happened in my server, I only ever had like two. And one of them was because of like the tournament that I was like running, so like... I didn't care personally to do it. Favorite way to cook eggs? Scrambled? Scrambled eggs, I guess? With like, a bit of ABC sauce. And of course, salt and pepper. The purple Ryan staring into the soul. Yeah, my boy Ryan has to be there. When's he going to return to King and Mega? Uni. Oh, don't remind me of that. That thing. That thing's evil. I think the thumbnails are right. It's, bit, it's very simple, but. It should be fine. So, yeah, when my strikes disappear, expect Adam vs. Garo as one of the videos. I'm going to have some fun with that. I do enjoy making like cross vs. stuff like this. I'm starting uni this year. Good luck, my G. I guess better for you because now COVID is pretty much over, but yeah, I hope it goes well. Hope you have a good time. Yeah. Should I make it white? What does it look like when it's white? Uh, nah, red's better. What other things do I could do? I think Sai. I can't do really a Saitama video because I'm going to get all those like if I do a crossverse video with Saitama involved I'm going to get all those comments saying like Saitama, One Punch Man, stuff like that Finish his first semester, nice Tenkaichi, I make Tenkaichi videos I don't like review every chapter but I make a video on like every fight once it ends so the current fight, Hanzo versus Sasaki. I do predict Sasaki is going to win, but I'll make a video once that fight is over. Hopefully Tenkaichi gets more traction because it's pretty underrated. Like, it's like Terra, something like that. It's kind of manga. Yeah, so I made a video on Kamazumi versus Hino. I made a video on these two. Hanzo sweep. I think Sasaki's going to win for like the narrative and he was already portrayed in one of the recent chapter as like now that Kamazumi is gone, he's like the strongest now or something. There's like some implication there. Sorry that video did very poor. Anagi, Anagi. Hanzo sweep. Hey, if you believe, you believe. Alright, what's the time? I'll probably stream for like 10 or so more minutes. So if you've got any last second questions, let me know. Then I'll be probably making food and then going to the gym before it gets too hot. There's going to be like 40 degrees today apparently for me, which is like unheard of. Don't know how that came out of nowhere. Pretty wild. I'll also leave the stream on public now because I don't really use this channel for anything. Ooh. The cracks of my old body, unlucky, unlucky. Hanzo seems pretty cool so far. Hopefully it's like a good fight. I hope it's not like a one-sided stomp type thing. That would be 
unfortunate, but up probably going to be pretty good. Most fights so far have been good. Even the stomp between Adam and that other guy, I forgot his name right now. That was like short, a stomp, but I enjoyed it. I think we probably have enough material for like a 12 episode like anime season. Maybe after one more fight we'll have enough. I started going to the gym yesterday. It's a day two and my knees feel so sore. That is ripped. My knees are kind of like busted up from like poor squat form. So that needs to, you know, slowly be recovered. And I hurt my shoulder swimming like two weeks ago. It's like still sore. So I don't know. My body slowly breaking down. If Venos did like the YouTube boxing thing, that would probably bring like a lot of viewers into it. Be pretty cool. My knees hurt for some reason, but I like it. You like your knees hurting, eh? I don't know what you're on, mate. Does the, for some reason, have a winky face attached? That's the real question. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, since I'm streaming, I have to do the stream like a ritual like every stream this one thing occurs and it is about to occur yeah anime would be dope it would boost popularity of Tenkaichi by a lot yeah so long it isn't done dirty that's how it's gonna boost popularity but when before Rekko Ragnarok actually goes anime it was already doing pretty well in like the Japan like ranking charts I don't know about Tenkaichi so it definitely help more but the stream ritual is, see this page? It's my Twitter, you should follow. For real, for real. You're a very motivational person. Hey, I respect that. I wouldn't say I'm that motivational to other people, but I'm very motivated myself. Your favorite character that uses removal, Ryan. Literally my favorite character in Kangen, period. I have liked all posts should be known being ages. Marco just built different. What can I say? See, I acquired a new follower. See, Gr great success. Great success. Chaotic Zero. Respect to you, mate. What is this guy sending me? I just checked like my Twitter DMs that were like hidden. There's like some weird ass shit in here. Like, I don't know. I'm not gonna click on that. Our boy Himmy has provided the goods by following. So we like to see. Sometimes that's what I'm about. Others just being motivated. Hey. I guess that works. Oh. The grind shall not end. I am sweating so much now. So the stream shall end so I can. Turn on the aircon and wither away before I depart to the gym. Which will probably be hot as fuck as well. And I want to get to the gym before like the high school kids finish. Because like when they arrive then it's like so loud and like too many people. So if I go before that it will be very good. So I hope you enjoyed the stream. I've, if you, you know... If you're watching now, like the stream later on, I explained what's going on with the videos and the main channel, like at 50 different parts in the video. So just watch through. You'll know what happens. Just quickly, free strikes on main channel. Can't upload for like three or four weeks or two or three weeks while I appeal them. And that's it. When I return, expect Garo vs. Adam because that was a very interesting video I want to make now. Probably some other video. If the Okubo vs Seki fight is done, I'll have like a video talking about that. And probably the Record of Ragnarok chapter as well, because I'll be out. There may be uploads on this channel, or maybe another stream or two. In the meantime, we'll have to wait and see, but that is it for now. Laters, have a good day. 
and yeah, peace.